being said, let's take a look at some of the best. Welcome to 10 of the most hilarious Pokemon Go photos. Sometimes Pokemon have been known to pop up in some rather inappropriate places, but I don't think it gets more inappropriate than this. Out of all the possible Pokemon that could have appeared on his crotch, it just would have had to have been that Diglett. Pokemon Go has literally spread everywhere, as this photo shows a marine in Syria choosing his starter Pokemon whilst fighting on the front line against Isis. Shame he chose Squirtle though. Everyone knows Charmander is the best starter. This is one of those humorously macabre photos. A rat is turned next to a dead rat outside a supermarket. Less than a week and there's already photos like this. Pokemon Go really does take you to some exotic locations. This one isn't really a funny photo, so to speak. It's more of a story of justice, and Pokemon Go helped a girl find out her boyfriend was cheating on her with his ex. The app uses geolocation to record the exact location where every Pokemon was caught. The girl was using her boyfriend's Pokemon Go and noticed he caught Pikachu at his ex-girlfriend's house. She dumped him instantly. Way to go, Pikachu. This poor Magikarp. It seems to get the roughest ride of all the Pokemon. Always out of water, flapping around and gasping for air. Come over, my parents are out. I can't, there's a Snorlax block in the road. Of course they must have been joking, but I wonder how long it'll be before we hear stories of Pokemon Go ruining relationships. This guy is waiting for his partner to give birth, but instead of showing his support, he's secretly playing Pokemon Go. I guess if you want to be the very best, you have to show dedication like this. This person found an Abra using their toilet. It seems even Pokemon have needs too. I do hope they gave it some privacy before they caught it. This cheeky little squirrel had appeared right at movie star Idris Elba's feet whilst he was at the premiere for the new Star Trek movie. The thing that makes me laugh is this person was not interested in all the stars. Instead, they stood there playing Pokemon Go. Not sure how that little squirrel got up there, but I personally think this is one of the best photos so far. As the game is quite new, I'm sure pics like this are just the start. I guess we can look forward to many more creative and hilarious photos in the years to come. And that brings this list to an end. If you enjoyed the video, then it would be much appreciated if you give it a thumbs up and shared it. If you're new around here, then why not subscribe for new videos just like this every week? Anyways, I truly will hope you liked it, and as always, thanks for watching. exaggeration to say that it's already changed the world in many ways since. 20 years after the franchise first launch, Pokemania is everywhere again. From causing stampedes to giving robbers new ways to lure victims, to getting people outside into the sunshine, the game has had all sorts of ripple effects that nobody could have foreseen. Listed below are 15 real life incidents that have happened because of Pokemon Go, good and bad. Man quits job to become a full time Pokemon Go player. Tom Curry from New Zealand has gone and done something all of us dream of doing, but probably won't ever have the balls to do. He quit his job so that he can become a full-time Pokemon Go player for the next two months, during which time he'll be embarking on a tour across New Zealand. He's already caught 90 Pokemon at the time of writing this feature. I wanted to have an adventure, he says. I've been working for six years, and I was desperate for a break, and Pokemon gave me the chance to live that dream. This man will be the very best, like no one ever was. Pokemon Go players help save overdosing men. The search for Pikachu is one that can save lives, and this story here is the perfect example of that. Three people in the Lowell, Massachusetts area were playing Pokemon Go and looking for a Pikachu when they came across a man overdosing on drugs. They called the ambulance and the man was soon revived in a hospital. It felt nice to know that I helped someone, said one of the three players. However, we don't know if they ever did find that Pikachu. The Pokemon Go player finds a dead body. Seven News in Boston reports that a Pokemon Go player found a dead body in New Hampshire. According to the report, the body was found in a brook at Rotary Park in Nashua. The player found the dead body while searching the locality for pocket monsters. It was also reported that the park was a popular site for Pokestops. Could the two incidents be related? Hmm. Two men fall down a cliff while playing Pokemon Go. Two men in California got really into Pokemon Go while they were playing it, so much so that they didn't pay attention to their surroundings or where they were walking and fell straight down, one of them falling 50 feet down onto the bluffs, while the other fell around 80 feet onto the beach. Thankfully, they only sustained moderate injuries. Authorities said that while there have been such incidents in the past before, none of them have occurred because of Pokemon Go. Nintendo does not realize just what they have done. 
Pokemon Go player gets stabbed while playing continues playing anyway. A 22-year-old student in Oregon showed his absolute dedication to the quest of becoming the very best. On his way to a convenience store at around 1 a.m., supposedly to buy beer and chips and also catch Pokemon, when he came across another man who was also using his phone at the time. The student in question asked the man if he was also playing Pokemon, who then proceeded to stab him in the shoulder. The student, making the ultimate illustration of the phrase, walk it off, continued on to the store anyway, where someone saw his injuries and finally called the police. I guess he wanted to battle because he came at me with a knife, the student said. Technically, he isn't entirely wrong. Pokemon Go players wage war over the White House gym. The White House is a Pokemon.